Hello, so I was going to today, I was going to try and do a tutorial, but um, I've lost some of my brushes. It's my small angle brush, um, which is kind of important when I do, especially the look I wanted to do today because I don't have any of the brushes small enough. So um, I had to forego that plan. Um, so today I'm going to talk to you about collecting and not the type of collecting where I like something. So I'll collect it like, I don't know, people collect different types of makeup. I'm talking about the over the top collecting when you actually hoard stuff. Um, and I must admit I do hoard stuff, which is really bad. I'm currently having a clear out of my room, which is why the video is like, so you can't see the mess of the rest of my room which spreads out there there's like a little tidy bit including my bed and the rest of it I'm not going there um, so yeah I believe my holding on my dad is an attribute I've got from my dad you should I'm not I'm not gonna go there either um, but I think I said in my previous video I have a lot of makeup but most of it's from when I was like 11 younger um, so, this, it's not huge because I threw, threw a lot out of it last time, but this is a collection of makeup and nail polish on top of this, which I need to go through and show you, and sort out because most of it is wear, and I think a lot of it's probably gone off. Um, I've got this one, if you can look, I've had that since, I don't know, I think I was under 10 when I got this one, so yeah, it's a bit manky, so that definitely needs throwing up, I'm not even going to put that back in the box, it's going there, so I can throw it away once I've finished filming. Um, but I also have lots of jewellery. Nope. Start that bit again. I also have lots of jewellery. So there's this, which I gathered over recent years. So this stuff is rather recent, but my problem is it's all in this bag, so I don't know what I have. So literally all I wear is this my necklace and then these four earrings which practically look the same because they're all silver um, so yeah. but on top of that I also have this so these are all my jewellery boxes I have this one which I think is really pretty I got this my birthday years ago but if you look inside there is just a tangle of necklaces dangle earrings studs and then the bottom even more of a tangle of bracelets and I'm not sure what else so there's that can't even close it as you can see this one I think has got perfume in it I'm not gonna go near it because I don't think I can close it again this one I don't think is if I can open it no I can't open that bit one one handed I think it's got stuff in just a couple of earrings this also isn't quite as bad there but when you get oh, I can't keep the camera steady sorry I will try not to make you seasick um, more bracelets an earring which I actually know the pair of that is on the floor behind me I've been wondering where that's been and then finally this one I can't even get into properly um, bring it to the light. It's got random bits and earrings and possibly key rings. I don't know. So that's that. And panning over, my final is this. I get given a lot of bath stuff and cream. And I don't generally take baths, I prefer showers, but I don't throw it out, so it literally all lives in this drawer. Well, it's only recently started to live in this drawer. It used to be in a drawer behind me, but I'm, as I said, 
I'm having a throwout and a reorganisation. So yes, this is the extent of my hoarding. Um, bleh. And then more stuff, but this is generally stuff I use not quite on a daily basis, but more often than the rest of the stuff which is scattered about my bedroom. So yeah, um, that is part of what I hoard. I also, oh, I don't know, everything. I've found pieces of paper from when, before I left school and that was two years ago, you know, notes and school books. Um, I'm off with books. I have a box over there, you know, one of the big boxes, probably bigger than that, filled with books from, again, from before I was ten, which, you know, I'm not going to read again. You know, some, like, classics I want to keep because I enjoy them and they're nice, very nostalgic, but some of them I'm just like, why am I keeping them? I, I just need to go through and be stern with myself. Um, which I'm not very good at doing, apparently. But yeah, Ooh, apologise. I think this video is going to be really short, but it's kind of late, um, so I don't want to be up too late filming because everybody else will go to bed, and if I'm sat here talking, it'll annoy them all. Um, blah, blah, blah. <coughs> so yeah. Um, that's kind of what all I've got to say. So yeah, um, if you hold stuff, you know, even if it's something really silly or even if you collect something, um, let me know in the comments below. Um, rate, comment, like, subscribe in whichever order again. It, it will be greatly appreciated. And I hope you enjoy this video and I will see you next time. Hopefully with this tutorial I've planned because I have ordered some new brushes and makeup-y stuff which I'm rather excited about so there possibly might be a video before the tutorial just be showing, showing you what I've got, you know it's nothing major exciting, it's kind of basics but, but basics I haven't got because I haven't really needed them in the past because I've just been like, yeah, let's just put eyeshadow on. So like stuff like primer. I'm just like, I just put eyeshadow on, and then like two hours later, being like, it's all falling off. And now watching other people's videos, just like primer. Why didn't I think of that? Well, I didn't think of that because I didn't know. So yes, I'm gonna finish this video before I continue rambling on. But 